Okay, I'm Rebecca King. I am the other Rebecca King. <laughs> you are obviously the original. <laughs> um, uh, I'm an RMT. I went to Brock. I have a degree in kinesiology. I did not want to be a kinesiologist. I had a daughter uh, when I graduated, so then I went to massage therapy school. I love being a massage therapist. I'm fantastic. If you need a massage, let me know. Um, but I did not choose a service business. I chose blog. Um, because probably about a year ago, my husband and I were sort of looking at life, universe, everything, and, um, and trying to figure out what I want to do when I grow up. And um, I, again, I love being a massage therapist, but we're looking at sort of the financial parts of it. I, I physically cannot work 40 hours a week. My hourly rate is great. I can only work 20 hours a week, like I can't. So if anything happens to him or his job or whatever, we're kind of screwed. So what else can I do? What else can I offer? Um, I've always been really, um, uh, I've been gifted at writing. I'm terrible at speaking. And, uh, and uh, so we thought, okay, and I've written blogs in the past that you know have had good engagement and, and, and interest. And we thought, okay, well, let's start a blog. Um, I have mental health issues, uh, depression, pretty hardcore sometimes. I had something negative happen last year that I took way, way the wrong way, took it really hard, put on a crap ton of weight, and the blog just completely fizzled out. It's there, it's not doing anything, it is definitely not making us any money. It's probably adding to my depressive thoughts because I'm not getting it done, I'm a terrible person, blah, 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 blah. Um, so I'm actually really excited when Candace contacted me over Instagram, hey, I'm doing this thing. I'm like, oh my gosh, like, I have to do it now because some, like, I'm really good if someone's counting on me, I, I won't let it down, I'll get it done. But if it's for me, it'll never happen. So, um, so I, I have a blog-ish. <laughs> it's, um, um, I think it's purpose. It's called Grit Gets Goals. Um, my husband and I, I, I did this form with him and uh, I really had a hard time picking like the value that I'm trying to add um, because I'm trying to talk about like navigating life and being successful with mental illness and, and, and whatever. So like I want to help and I want to educate and I want to inspire. So trying to of those three, what is the main one? Um, and we were like back and forth and it was quite the discussion really late last night trying to decide I finally circled inspire I think that that's what um, our purpose is is with um, with our website and what we're trying to do and um, I'm hoping obviously like from this what I want to get is just the, the motivation for myself and the accountability to keep it going to get it to where I need it to be and quite frankly I have <laughs> I've spent my entire life feeling like an outsider. I remember. I'm gonna cry. I'm gonna cry. <laughs> so I know everybody here. I'm trying. I'm trying to like hold back tears. Oh. I remember uh. though. I was. I remember being in middle school, and I was just this awkward girl. Like I just whatever. I don't do girl things. I don't. Whatever. This is like I'm gorgeous today. Yes, <laughs> damn right. <laughs> Woo! Cheers. But this is not what I. My sweaty selfies. That's me. Like that. That's what I look like. Um, but you can have both sides. Right? Yeah, I you just can don't be do both. the other side. Yeah, well, don't. now you have okay. a reason to, to honest, right? I didn't become girly until after I had two boys. <laughs> yeah. And yeah, I was very much a tomboy. And the majority of my clothes came from Valley <laughs> Village, okay? Like, trust me, I, I'm not, yeah, I'm not like. Like, yeah. Chick, like, up but this is so good yeah. because, like, sorry, not to interrupt, but nobody knows the stuff. That's what, exactly. It's so misunderstood from my Instagram. People thinking that I think I'm the shit, and that's not what I. And think that's at all. why we're gonna redefine all your guys' yeah. social medias because you, like I said, you have a bigger purpose here than what I. And knowing you as people is why you're here. But I think one of the things I'm probably again most excited about the motivation and just getting off the ground and getting and doing my work for myself um, is you know I'm in middle school I remember hearing that some kid was moving in and I literally I'm religious like well, I went to church this morning that's why I'm pretty today <laughs> and, uh, and and I remember praying that this person moving into my school would be my friend like praying and he wasn't 
Good. You know, and, and I and I have spent my life feeling like I'm on the outside and I watch girls get together and, and go to the movies and I watch girls do things and I don't know how to do that and so I'm, I'm really excited for the business aspect of it but I'm hoping that I'm going to get some girlfriends because I'm 36 and I don't have any. You all, you're all my friends. Everybody I know. So that's it. Everybody, that's it. everybody. Okay.